Yo, what is up guys? So for today, we're going to be talking about Destiny 2, not specifically. We're going to be looking at the seasonal challenges for week 7. Uh, it's only 6 of them, so it's nothing too crazy. And I've already completed a few because I, I play the game. But unfortunately, there's a few things that I kind of wish worked retroactively. But what the fuck ever, let's get on with it. So first and foremost, Contenders Ascent 6, I want to say? 7. That's 7. Yeah. Uh... Challengers proven six completed. Basically, just do a challenge proven. Um, put a put a medal on the hammer and then just do that. Uh, get a hundred kills with an SMG. Not that hard. This is this you're gonna get this if if you just do it. This is like super easy. Uh, proving proving grounds trifecta. Complete the following in the proving grounds strike. Finish the mission. Defeat combatants and deposit a power core in the undercarriage of the land tank. This one, I've already done the strike. I'm going to have the review literally right after this video. And, uh, yeah, it was fun. I liked it a lot. Uh, this one, just play the strike and you'll get this eventually. It's not that hard. Uh, one against many, calibrate weapons by repeat re repeatedly defeating three or more combatants. I literally got this while I was doing the strike, so this one will not take you long at all. Diplomacy or death... Listen to intercepted transmissions at their radio kiosk in the helm. I literally got this like when I logged in because I do that. Like, just listen to all the transmissions. I don't know if they if they reset daily or weekly, but there that is. Can't, can't, oh, that sucks. Gambit Salvager Salvo. Acquire the tox toxicology ornament for the Salvager Salvo grenade launcher. Uh, this one's not hard. It's just that you do have to play Gambit, like a good fair, a good bit of it. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, the best thing I can do, I, I have a video out for this. I'll have it in the comments below. Uh, also, if you hear the air, I do apologize, but I live in Florida and it's super hot right now. So there, that is. Uh, then last but not least, Beyond Legendary, earn Valor ranks. I have five. If I remember correctly, you have to earn not. Let me see. So currently, I think I'm at Legend right now. Yeah, I'm at Legend. So the next one is going to be Guardian, Guardian 1, Guardian 2. You have to actually earn the, like, the Guardian 1 counts as 1, and then Guardian 2 and 3 do not. And then the next one, which is, I like, don't even, Heroic, I think. Heroic 1 is, like, the next rank up. So at least that's how it was explained to me. But... That's pretty much it. We're going to be reviewing the new weapons that came out for Iron Banner. I know I'm a little late on that, but uh, just a bunch of stuff has been happening. We're going to review the weapons for Iron Banner. We might do some reviews for the Igneous Hammer. I got two because I that's, that's the most willpower I had to do. And I like the one that I got. At least I would have I would have much preferred a uh, Rampage one, but whatever. And we're definitely going to do the... The character reviews where I, like the seasonal ones that i do for each character so uh let me know what you guys think about the challenges i think they're pretty simple especially since we're losing one again um as you guys can see we had 10 then 9 then 7 then 6 and then or 7 then 6 so these aren't hard at all like honestly especially like if you want to get this one which is if, if i remember correctly like 10,000 000 um, bright dust or some shit like that so these are definitely worth it as for these are these are definitely worth your time considering that each of these can gain you a level most of the time so highly recommend it if you guys want to follow me on my social media all these links are in the description below i thank you all for coming up to this point and i'll see you guys later